Oh, hello there, I didn't see you. Oh, so this is what it's like to have the uh, the sloped end Harry. So bitch, normally got the tap end. Oh, some music will be nice. Bit of uh, a bit of six string, I think. Is the Richard Gere Jebel story true? Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh, yeah. It's salty sleep with Sue These things I think about When I'm out with Oh, bollock The son of a bitch! I've flooded the bathroom! Alright guys, happy homebrew Wednesday! I'm all bathed uh, So you can open your eyes now, I'm out <laughs> uh, we are brewing old school, um, going back to my roots, I'm doing a banana wine, oh yeah, I'm brewing in the uh, Demijohn again, uh, haven't brewed using a Demijohn since uh, I went all grain, so, um, so here it is, I was actually looking through a few of the old videos trying to sort the channel out and uh, realise that the most popular video that I've done is how to make a banana wine. In fact if you search in how to make a banana wine my video is the first one that comes up. It's, it's quite popular. Quite a few comments have been received over the past months. Um, I'm, I'm receiving comments on that video all the time asking for a for me to brew it again, brew up other wines and whatnot. So um, it's a good wine. It's it's lovely. I wanted to brew it up again. There's a couple of people that I'm going to be sending it out to that have very kindly sent me beer. So talking about beer, let's crack open one that Harry sent me, uh, which is a vanilla porter. And I do believe it's in the bottle that I sent with the hopped English bittering. So let's get it cracked and then we can look at where we are with the banana wine. Look at that bad boy. Vanilla Porter. Cheers Harry. You're a star. So the wife is at work. Uh, which is unusual because it's Wednesday. I'm actually brewing on a homebrew Wednesday video. Drinking a homebrew. Can't get any better than that. Ah, oh, smells good. My God, Harry. That is smooth. So anyway, here we go. Banana wine. Son of a bitch, my arm. Banana wine. Um, let's have a look at her. There she is, guys. Uh, just bringing her up to the boil. Two kilograms of locally grown bananas um, grown two miles away from where I live <laughs> so I fill this pan up this is roughly a gallon's worth of, of water in there and we boil the bad boy up skin and all we boil it up 20 minutes half an hour and you end up with like a baby food puree sort of grey gloopy mess and then we strain it through a muslin bag uh, we add citric acid, we add clearzyme, we add yeast nutrient, we add 250ml of grape concentrate, but I'm using the full pouch because they come in, I think it's 400 grams. Let me check it. Yeah, 400 gram 
pouch of, of grape concentrate, white grape concentrate, goes in there and a kilogram of brewing sugar, which I've also got. Um, you strain it off into the demijohn, you cool the mother down and then you pitch your yeast and away you go. So we're going to pop in and out when this is sort of going through the stages. Um, if you want to sort of watch the video where I brew it and nothing else, the sort of more in depth how to make a banana wine video, I will leave a link in the description box below and uh, and yeah that goes through it in a bit more details. This is a homebrew Wednesday so we don't want to be making it too long. Eh? Oh, 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 yeah, gotta get it nice and clean. Oh yeah, start of the boil. Oh yeah, baby. So let's uh, set the old timer, Alamar. Pardon me. And uh, give it a bit of a stir. Bit of a stir up. And uh, what happens is, you can see they're starting to, starting to burst out of the, out of the skins, and they'll start to mosh down, and uh, release all them beautiful sugars, and flavours, fantastical. It's quite funny brewing this up again because I was sort of uh, really new to everything when I first did this banana wine and uh, I was really impressed with how it turned out when he told me about using the bananas and keeping the skins on and you need the tannins and, and whatnot uh, and then I got it in the damage on it looked like shit I was so impressed when I tasted it I was uh, blown away really I was amazed so we'll leave that to do its half an hour boiling smelling gorgeous already had the grains arrive cheers Harry uh, from idlevalleybrewing.com uh, but the grains have arrived uh, for the SJ challenge um, I don't even know if I'm going to tell you what they are I don't want to give anything away but uh, but there's the old box there with them still in, I need to shift them in a minute. And uh, and yeah, so I'm looking forward to it, guys. I really am. I, I can't wait to get stuck in. Okay, so the time has gone off. That's half an hour done. And look at it now. Nice and grey. Sloppy. And uh, it looks nothing like what you get at the end, which is a lovely quality white wine. So let's uh, strain her, get her into the damage on and uh, add the sugar and cool the bitch down. So there we go guys, straight out of the pan and into a, well this is a fine uh, straining bag, it's actually the muslin bags aren't big enough for this. This is huge, this is massive. Um, into a colander and underneath a sanitized pot just to collect the beautiful beautiful liquor so what we've added now <coughs> what we've added now is the, uh, the sugar the grape juice concentrate uh, the citric acid and I'm about to add the the clear zyme uh, what I forgot to say was to add a cup of tea so just get a mug tea bag in it, boil your water as if you're going to make yourself a cup of tea and just leave it to mash. Uh, that is going to be your tannins that you're going to add to the wine. The wine needs tannins. Right, it's, it's done guys. It's finished. Um, <clears throat> give it a go. Banana wine. I do eventually want to do a five gallon batch of this. Uh, the yeast is in. I've just added some yeast nutrient and uh, you want to leave plenty of headspace for the fermentation. Um, got some cheap vodka in the airlock. Uh, and once the fermentation has, has 
completed you want to boil up a bit of water let it cool down and top her up to the neck and leave it leave it to clear um, I'll do an update video because you have to add a cabinet tablet to it to, to start clearing it uh, and then potassium sorbate and whatnot so that's it guys so I'm out I hope you've enjoyed this because I know quite a few people have been asking for it so that's it I'm going um, happy homebrew Wednesday I just said that you son of a gun I'm going don't forget to subscribe don't forget to thumb up this video and uh, I'll see you next week guys pinky out I'm gone